fire front in the country's history. We're gonna get stuck here. <laughs> me dead. Roaring back to life. We need to get out of here. Yeah. In Nowra, the fire jumped the Shoalhaven River. I'm scared witless. Either side of the Princess Highway, the main escape route was a bonfire. I just heard a loud kaboom five or ten minutes ago. The blaze has been hibernating for weeks in these conditions. It burned with intent. The might of defence outmuscled in the face of this latest threat. This is at Camberwara, looking towards Kangaroo Valley. The monster crawling up and over the escarpment. A fire so hot and so volatile, it's created its own weather system, sending down ash rain. Towns were cut off as the roads shut. Anyone east and west of the highway from Nowra to Kyola told to seek shelter. Thick dry forest along the Clyde River erupting too. Surrounding Batemans Bay with fire. The colour of that, the heat in that, all my best had to have to go now. The front doing what crews feared, crossing the King's Highway and heading towards the coast. Power was cut and whoever hadn't evacuated was told to seek shelter or get to the water. Urgency was paramount. Voila, we gotta go. Locals grabbed hoses to help the RFS. Everyone and everything just trying to stay alive. It's pretty hot. That's Badala there. It's coming straight over that hill roaring. North Batemans Bay, Surfside and Long Beach all in its direct path. Rows of caravans lined as close to the ocean as possible. As people fled, there were reports of a man looting their homes. Others stayed and defended them themselves. We've worked hard for this, so I'm not going to let it burn down, mate. Evacuation centres, a refuge just full of anxiety. I'm just finding it really stressful. It's sort of, you know, we're just sitting here and we won't know anything until it's all over. Further south at Maruya, the fight was on too. Fiery's trying to keep it from heading into town, where people were just doing the best they could. There's not many places that we can go anymore. A blood orange Naruma would be bustling this time of year. It's like a war zone, very scary. They lost power as fires burned to the north, west and south of them. Everyone's left town, just about. Some locals, a makeshift campsite, was their evac centre. Uh, I don't know, anything will be normal again. 
Everything's just been turned upside down. A southerly is moving through the fire grounds right now and it will not ease the threat. We are in for a long night and I, I make no bones about that. We're in for a long night and uh, we're, we're, we've still yet to hit the worst of it. Chris O'Keefe, Nine News. I'm going to show you live shots now of that bushfire burning near Batemans Bay. These are coming in from our news chopper over the fire ground. Uh, you can see the line of flames there and the smoke that is coming up from that fire ground. Our reporter Jonathan Kersley is in the town of Batemans Bay. Uh, Jono, it has been tense there all day. How is the emergency threat level now? Well, the emergency warning still in place for the uh, North Batemans Bay fire behind me. The southerly change has come through within the last half an hour or so. It is blowing bits of debris in our faces, uh, dust and grass and bits from trees as well. The firefight here, though, and the fire threat far from over. While the fire might have moved away from those smaller communities, water bombers continue to go into that blaze. It is still going to be an anxious few hours ahead. Jane? All right, Jonathan Kersley there in Batemans Bay. Thank you. Now let's go to Ruth Wynne williams who's in Naruma for us tonight. Ruth, locals there are still on edge after a very long day bracing for the worst. Oh, Jane, it has been such a long and strange day for the people who evacuated here to Naruma. Fire is burning on virtually every side of this town and as those fires heated up today, the sky here took on that almost otherworldly bright orange glow and very strangely, there was almost no wind at all but there's been no time for people to feel relieved about that we've just felt that southerly it's come sweeping through here and it's changed the direction of the fire front around here that fire is now charging north and jane tonight it's heading straight towards properties at Bedella. a long night ahead there ruth win williams thank you